and um uh play i have okay every time i say us name like yeah. one part of just like tells me well what was his tag again uh and then and then like i i swear to god oh, yeah, i just the, have like this half a second of realization like oh his tag oh, second. Oh. <laughs> so. i hate his tag so much it incessantly bothers me Ugh, anyhow so jumping into game one uh, not able to get anything started, but the peak gave fire into the down air, up air. Oh, that combo was almost sick, but that platform wasn't there. Mm, yeah, 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 he had to uh, push the peak under a little bit farther to the right so it wouldn't cancel into the platform. Um, but right now, not able Ooh, nice to move. land yeah. quite yet. Let's stall talk there from Hodge just to see if we can get something out of uh, uh, but... Uh, to the back of those PK fires, very lethal tool in this matchup. As, uh... That PK fire would force uh, Hotch to commit to some options. That was pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Hotch oh, got a little looks, bit greedy. That looks safe, but I didn't think it was. Like, it, that was weird to me. No, no, Hotch definitely got like a little bit greedy. PK, uh, PK Thunder got shield. Um, has like so much shield stun because of oh, just yeah, how strong that move is. It's, it's and very it, strong move. Like you block it and not parry it, it's just there forever. Yeah, <laughs> it's actually unfortunate that I uh, got the full hit of the up here. Because if he got the dragon on up that like he was intending, he could have confirmed it. And it killed him. Uh, but oh, finally, the back is, is going to take it. <laughs> Ooh, with the scoop to the side B, not going to take it though. But that was pretty good for stage control right here. Oh no, misses the down there. Gotta be careful now because you're not off stage against Ness. Yeah, Rob has the ability to stall under Ness and be able just to, you know, boink him with, with an up air. Oh, that looked like an input error right there. Hey, quick side note, I forgot to mention this is going to be bad. Oh, the rest of the fives? Okay. Got it. What just happened? Uh, he died. He just died. But <laughs> how did he die? I didn't just feel like expired. he said that. I wish I was paying attention to that. <laughs> he fell to the ground. He's dead. Awesome. Go back to uh, Animal Town over here. Mm -hmm. Uh, over committing. Oh, look yeah. how much damage he took from <laughs> whipping that PK fire. That was awesome. Try to approach him with a magnet, I see you. Ooh, could have rushed him with an attack, but uh, yeah. He had a good idea, but he's just a little bit too slow with the execution of it. Oh, this is gonna get a heavy punish here, but nope. This is a simple up here. I'm liking that uh, boosted upbeat that Hodge is doing just to try to catch something. Follow up, whatever he hits him with. That was so risky. Uh, uh, he whiffed a back alley, then he immediately went for the neutral layer as Rob was charging the smash attack. Like, he keeps whiffing these double jumps in Poncho's face, and I can't help but suspect that he is going to get blown up for it sooner rather than later. Um, down tilt just to get in a little bit of stage. That's going to be the barely into the oh, up throw. Up Excuse me. Oh, the Nair off the stage. That's going to take the next stock right there. So, oh, uh, it's now up. Ooh, the <laughs> I dude went 10, 10 uh, minutes into the future right there just to see that coming. That's pretty good. That PK fire coming into play again. Rob being big enough to get hit by all of that. So Hotch is really with his landings. Um, and he's just like waiting for uh, to commit to PK fire so that he has like he can land while uh, stuck in that lag. So it uh, has to be just a little bit more reserved and patient because Rob obviously doesn't have infinite stalling potential. Rob can't like stay there. Ooh, very tough for Hodge to try to come back on because uh, uh, stage was pretty good, and that trade should be it. Yeah. Yep. Oh, do you think? Do you think you could turn on the uh, noise? Noise cancel. What? The noise suppression. The Discord noise suppression thingy. Oh, that's a thing. Yes. We can do that. Mm -hmm. I wish. I do, wish. Do you, see, <laughs> do, do you see like the thingy next to? Um, Sorry. Do you see the thingy next to next to the disconnect button? Disconnect. Like the noise suppression. Uh, it's like five no, vertical lines. Oh, these? Okay. Noise suppression. Got it. Yeah, so just like click on that and then, oh. then click on the little switch. Okay. Is that better? Um, no, be never mind. It's a lot worse. Because, it's actually a lot worse. Yeah, no, no, no because like, there's some background noise. It's up to you. Whatever uh, you can keep it on. I'm not, I'm not, it's, it's, it, you can do whatever you want. Yeah, my niece is super loud, sorry about that. <laughs> it's okay, it's cute, you're, you're all good. Just FYI, yeah. I'm blocking the arena for a second. 
that hot summer message thing that's the five points. Uh, uh oh, because, they don't know uh, what's the five. They didn't know when they started the match, and I want to make sure that they never put them too. Oh, yeah, I could definitely throw people off. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely been an unpleasant surprise with Wade. I have to play to another match. And went to the, <laughs> I got the reverse 2 0 1. Crazy. Dude, what do you mean this is best of five? <laughs> what do you mean this is best of five? What are you talking about? Yeah, I gotta get like into looking how to noise suppress with my microphone. I've seen it done before, it was pretty sick. Watching someone just like use these mics and then like you can hear nothing else but just the person's voice. Not even the background noise. <laughs> I saw that recently, it's pretty cool. Man, who could win today? I feel like is kind of ignoring everything. That's not like the, the, the set procedure thing. Maybe She's a little just the match. You ever have the theory of how people change, like how they are when they're playing in tournament compared to how they are in person? <laughs> That could be a, th a thing, you know. Wait, what do you mean, like Wi-Fi versus in person, or do you think? No, it's like competitive mode into casual mode, like how they talk to people normally, but then when they're in tournament, they're a completely different person. Like now, you just can't talk to that person anymore. Oh, or something. interesting. Yeah, I mean, I know, I know a couple of people like that, like some really great people outside, but maybe they get like a little bit too emotionally into it competitive. Mm, yeah. The counting pick. Oh, I hate let's to go. See it. Oh, Mr. no. Hodge. Hodge, Hodge, buddy. Oh, I'm talking about Hodge. No, it's not. And he took him to the battlefield. Yes. This makes me oh, upset. Let's go. Let's go. So, for those of you guys that don't know, this is a. You're feeding him. <laughs> don't feed him. <laughs> Uh, this is this is a pretty rough matchup for Ness. Definitely one of his most difficult ones, especially on Battlefield. Ness just sort of struggles to continue to follow up to land on Game and Watch's shield. I feel like Game and Watch does a really good job of sort of invalidating everything that Ness really really likes to do. Um, uh, is just resorting to staying on those platforms, and as a result, Hotch is just jumping every second with those neutralers. And uh, he needs to needs to be playing a lot more grounded. But it's actually no one. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay. He's catching him right there on recovery. Yeah, Game Watch is definitely the typical character that changes the whole way you have to play the game. Because he's playing his own game. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's throwing out those magnets preemptively just in case Hotch throws out a foiler. Because if the foiler does detonate on uh, Nessa's magnet, it heals him for an absurd amount. One of the highest oh, of any projectile. Ooh, catches him on the, the recovery there, on the landing. Yep, it was a good down smash. Um, oh, oh and, and because he got the actual projectile rather than the the individual boost, that is going to be the one that actually fuels the bucket really, really powerfully. He yeah. He, was... Oh my god, that's a powerful bucket. Because, like, like the individual PK fire hits. Ooh. Oh, some other. Yeah. The individual PK fire hits aren't like that big of a deal. Like they barely do any damage, but the actual projectile is. <laughs> it's kind of cool looking at uh, Hodge do it too because Hodge is like, like Hodge looks like he's doing it just to move around, but at the same time that's also covering any projectile thrown at him too. Mm -hmm. It covers his landing really, really safely, Ooh, but a little oh, what? Yeah, yeah, that, was, that looked like a little bit of suspect guy yeah, on the back end. Yeah. Regardless. Hotch is just keeping oh, that down oh, right back. juggled. Why does it sound like that if he swings his hammer and his bug is on? I don't even think they used to kill like that. That was weird. <laughs> oh, gets a full bucket now. This combo is about to be epic. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, but he double jump magneted right over the if bucket. If that was nine, that would have been a... Think about that. Think about that as you play neutral game. Oh, the thunder's absorbed. Yeah. Ooh. Nice I'll be able to avoid the PK fire. Let's see if uh, uh can get us all back here again as he takes the first get up attack that. Oh, but he goes for the drop down forward. Yes, that's much more optimal. Just went for the damage instead. Really, really good idea on his part. Um I uh, need to be careful about the next next projectile that he throws out. But uh, I Wait, you said you can buckets. get up attack that yo yo right there? I thought that was destroying it. No no no, you can you get up attack outlasts uh more, more almost always outlasts Ness's range. Uh, okay. Down smash. 
But the back end is going to be able to take it. Yep. Oh, it takes a bow. It takes that game number two really, really well with that back air. That was his main tool. He got all the stocks off of uh, Hotch's character. Well done to uh, playing that pretty well. That's kind of kind of work in uh, Hotch's fa uh, favor. He just uh, slow nest down a bit and not get hit by those. Uh, uh, Troublesome air moves from Ness. As Ness is not going to be throwing those projectiles out at him all the time. So, yeah, for sure. Um, I mean, I feel like I was definitely a, like a lot more uncomfortable. But I, the only times like Hutch, Hutch was sort of losing his stocks is when. He was over committing to bucket as he was landing. I feel like, and and, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna back up you on this. Um, I think Hotch could definitely afford to play this. I don't want to say lamely, but he, he could definitely be afford. He could afford to be playing a whole lot more back, a whole lot more defensively, a whole lot more. Um, because honestly, one of the best things that game launch does is uh, like with punish Ness. I feel like. Guys, yeah, did I like, tell you how happy I am to see Ness Lucas and then Ness on stream? It actually just like makes me really, really happy. If you're a her foul fan and turn up. Stop Take simping for your main. I'm not simping for my main. I just, I just really like Ness. He's a good kid. Hey, yeah. you don't, don't use the term simp for Ness and Lucas. Use the term uh, fan. Yeah. That's a better term. Oh, oh no, no, why that? It's, it's, it's been 10,000 years. Look at him, and he's actually just able to completely pass through the dashes. This is a clown fiesta of a matchup. Yeah, I'm not... Honestly. Okay, I want to say this now. Like, I'm not really liking the use of Hotch's bucket. Because uh, Hotch could be using this for, like, pressure or, or combos or whatever, but... I feel like the bucket's being thrown away once he gets it. Cause he's getting it really, like, a lot. This is... The way he's using it is not as... Not as well used right here. Ooh. Look how much less comfortable Hutch, uh, I mean, Uh is initiating in this matchup as opposed to Rob. He has to be so much more careful with the spacing. He has to be yeah, so much more careful there. the way that he's landing on. He's um, throwing the bucket away. Unfortunately, he missed space the bacon. He has to be a little bit farther back so that it doesn't arc over the ledge, so that it just goes passes right through the ledge. Hutch uh, just needs Bad. to. Ooh, he's a more, yeah. Edge of Lila, 102% game. Yeah, of course. <laughs> more than Ooh, the downer? Oh, okay, not gonna kill. Okay, the pressure's on. Saving oh, his jumps. But, uh, poor leader is unfortunately not strong enough on hit at such a low percent. Yeah. Hodge knew that he wasn't gonna be in stun for that long for that move, so... Mm -hmm. I saw a good down tilt for that kill. This is really nice movement from... He is dashing back and forth. Ooh. You see him, like, uh, jumping back and going for a little, um... I just say these things. Anyhow, it's just really, really, it's a nice change of pace for him. And it's catching on a lot. Yeah, he's keeping oh, in check with these with these buckets. This is the use of buckets is a little a little too soon. A little quick fire on it. Mm -hmm. You could probably save it a lot better, before, but I guess I, I I don't understand why he's throwing it out so fast too, because he could probably be throwing it out just to keep it as an absorbed tool as a I'm gonna throw this oil at you tool. <laughs> I did see uh, Hotch earlier like run in with the forwarder, like drop off from the platform. Just to cover his approach, that was pretty cool looking. Yeah. Um Hotch not able to punish down time. He might have had enough time to get up attack. I guess he just didn't want to risk it. Um Yeah, uh is struggling to land. Oh that was almost a scary situation for uh probably would have got the stage fight from that B. So, so Hodge has he just down smashed his shield and then Hodge go to punish it with F smash. Yeah, I'll, I'll look super stuck right there. Hodge is playing this really well, mm -hmm. keeping himself grounded, keeping uh, uh really scared. Mm -hmm. Again, like preemptively wasting his bucket. Um, he has to be a, a little bit smarter with its usage, I think. Nice double jump cancel magnet over Hodge's shield. Um, and he actually baited an aggressive recovery option by preemptively canceling the team. Don't give him those absorbs. <laughs> the forward is a good tool, but not, not that good. 
nice stalls oh, with I really have made off stage. Ball, but but oh, never mind. I'm gonna take all of that back. Uh that was a that was a bad stall, buddy. You were just like standing there and you're like, oh like, yeah. it was funny because like that stall looked good from way up there, but then as like he kept doing it, it was just like, alright, now it's just looking ridiculous. Let me just kill you for it. <laughs> good stuff to Hosh for taking that and uh, answers right back. Leaving to a really uh, close game right here. Oh, uh, there's up two games right here and uh, smoking with a PK fire. Mm -hmm. But you know, Hotch, this is like the first time that he's used up B out of the PK fire. That's something he could be a little bit more mindful of as well. Gonna get the um, back thrown off the stage. He's pushing it a little bit too far, but uh, not able to capitalize on the whip. Charge up smash on the ledge. Good stuff on hot to avoid it. Oh, the conversion off this? No, that's how I gotta take it. It's he went for drag down for the right smash. That would have, uh, that might be. Oh, you're getting scooped off of this. Good yeah. game. GG's. Ha. Ha. Got him. Um.